Here's what you missed on Drawfee. Jacob and Nathan accidentally kissed. Karina found herself in a slippery situation. Julia had a humiliating audition for the school show choir. <laughs> no one likes you singing! Oh yeah, and the gang found a secret tunnel beneath the high school that had all sorts of crazy holiday merch in it. Like the Jacob Horse long sleeve shirt, the Jacob Horse chain pin, the Drawfee tote bag, and a delete your art beanie. Anyway, that's what you missed on Drawfee! <laughs> Welcome to Drawfee, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Jacob. I'm Lasagna. And I'm Lasagna, too. I'm joined today by my two <laughs> Lasagnas <laughs> for a good reason. <laughs> and that reason is we got a suggestion from the Drawfee Patreon Discord user Squashy, who said, I am once again asking you to take Garfield minus Garfield and make it whole again. And so that's what we're going to do. We're going to put Garfield back. <laughs> yeah, his beautiful, iconic face, his world-famous T-shirt, and his hole. He's coming home. Uh -huh. He's been away for too long. Yep. <laughs> we need to bring him home. It, it really... It really tickled me the idea that Jacob would just be sitting in a room. <laughs> He's so lonely. Yeah. My two beautiful lasagnas. <laughs> wow, they're just on the floor. <laughs> Freshly baked lasagnas. Um, so yes, I've got three Garfield minus Garfield comics that I have placed here, and uh, I'd like for someone to roll me a random number one to three, and I'm gonna pick one that I'm gonna do. All right. So Julia's gonna roll you a number, and then yeah. you're just gonna pick one. Yeah, I'm gonna ignore what Julia <laughs> does, and I'm just gonna pick one. Sounds great. Yeah. So your number, Jacob, is one. Number one. <laughs> okay, so in this one, we got John Arbuckle uh -huh. saying, there, I think I've captured your essence and then showing, showing the picture, presumably to Garfield. Presumably, yeah. Who's not here. Yeah. So I need to put Garfield back in. It's important. It's important. We miss him. Uh, I'm just Sometimes gonna make this I can like this. Still hear his voice, <laughs> John. It's me, Garfield. Oh, it sounds different than I thought it would. No. It sounds like he's in slow mo. It's always sounded like this. Oh, John, I'm getting unstuck in time. Paint me like one of your French girls, John. I just went to Google and Googled images. Images. Take me to Google Images. Now I've done a Google <laughs> image search for images. <laughs> <laughs> What's the top image? What's yeah, the yeah, most yeah. image of the all most time? Image of all time is this photograph of a tree <laughs> <laughs> at night that is reflected in a, a pool of liquid. A pool of liquid. <laughs> yeah, a liquid pool. They should start calling the ocean that. <laughs> it's a pool. It's it's the world's largest pool of liquid. Yeah, it's a body of fluid. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I just want to see Garfield. <laughs> then why didn't you Google Garfield? <laughs> I'm making a lot of. I don't want to see Garfield 2024. I want to just see normal Garfield. <laughs> There's my president. <laughs> Garfield 2024. Garfield Let's go, 2024. baby. <laughs> Time to vote for a new party. The lasagna party. The Garf party. <laughs> He'll outlaw Mondays. <laughs> the vice president's just a lasagna. <laughs> Much like how the co-hosts on this episode are just lasagnas. Oh my God, does that mean we're vice president? Oh my God, because it does take two women to do the job of one man. That's one so true. One fat man, <laughs> yeah. All right, so here's Garfield. You know how like the president gives pardons? Mm -hmm. Do you think that Garfield's first thing would to be like, w would be to give an anti-pardon to normal? An, an anti-pardon. Anti <laughs> go directly to jail card. Yeah. Do not pass go. <laughs> Private plane. Why is he so big? <laughs> he really is kind of wide. Is this not it. how big he usually is? No, I like it. Yeah. How big is he usually? He's kind of got like, um. before you drew in the face, Why he had like a like Snoopy. A, really strong. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? That. He's really strong. Yeah, no, he's not strong. And John wants to commemorate his buffness. Wait, he's not strong. He's not strong. 
Oh, is that his belly? That's his belly. Oh. At first I was like, why are you drawing a penis shape? <laughs> this is how he looks. It's true. Yeah. It's not yeah. my fault. Take it up with Jimothy Davis if you got a problem. <laughs> I do have oh, a Jimothy. complaint about Garfield's design. His actual design or the way that I've drawn it? No, his actual design. Okay. Yeah. I hate Garfield's back feet. His big old like feet? It looks like he feet, stepped feet? on some bees. <laughs> he stepped on a bunch of bees. And he's having like an allergic reaction, but only in his feet. <laughs> Every morning he wakes up and steps on some bees. <laughs> It's like, I gotta get my signature look. Time to step on Stop some Stop stepping bees. on the bees, Garfield. They're it's, dying. John, it's part of my look. Garfield 2024, step on some bees. <laughs> Everyone's like, no, there's a crisis with the bees. We need the pollinators. Yeah, come on, Garfield. He's like, I don't need pollinators to make lasagna. And everyone's like, yeah, you do. You kind of do, Mr. Field. Mr. <laughs> First name Gar, last name Field. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we got um we got kind of like a, a sad, sagging, like stuffed animal of a Garfield. Yeah. This is normal Garfield. Yeah. <laughs> he's so dazed. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's been gone a long time from the comic. Yeah. And now he finds himself back in. <laughs> that takes some getting used to. It's like he went on a sabbatical and came back and he's like, what's the point of any of this? I thought I would enjoy it after my <laughs> sabbatical, but... Just cut me the check, John. <laughs> it's really just a paycheck at this point, John. I've showed up. Is that not enough? <laughs> John. I'll say the thing, John. I love lasagna. I do think it would be fun if instead of Garfield just doing whatever Garfield usually does. He's just like ragdolling <laughs> <laughs> at all times. <laughs> that does make it seem like Garfield died and John <laughs> had him like taxidermied. <laughs> John's like, I'm nothing without Garfield. My whole personality was in that cat. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of the vibe I'm giving <laughs> <laughs> you schlumped. Garfield. You're the only thing I had, Garfield. <laughs> this is a very relaxed looking taxidermy. Yeah. I'm impressed. It's like stuffed animal. Up. Yeah. How'd you do that? It looks so real. <laughs> I feel like it's easier for the taxidermy to look like really alarmingly still. Yeah. Yeah. But they always put them in an action pose as if they're yeah. not. And oh I'm my like, God. that's worse. Oh my God. I was on like work call with Jonah over the mm -hmm. weekend and we ended up just like like all of us in the call were just looking at like taxidermy rats. <laughs> and I like these ones. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> they're going. <laughs> that's 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 that Pokemon Whoa. of the family Hello. of rats. That's like they look like yes boy ice cream. Yes boy. <gasps> <laughs> Yeah, I was very delighted by these rats. They're not available for purchase anymore, but <laughs> we were just trying to find as many angles of these like, yes boy ice cream dancing rats as we could. <laughs> yes boy ice cream dancing rats, what a sentence. <laughs> okay, oh, we're getting a message. Please. Please. <laughs> Oh. 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 John! John! John, are you? John! Do you need to go to a therapist, John? <laughs> men you would rather else. men would rather do whatever this is <laughs> than go to therapy. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most tragic image I've ever produced. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Garfield's not dead. He's just somewhere else. I yeah. Don't, I don't think I put Garfield back into this. Like, I think <laughs> he's I, still gone. Yeah, he's still gone. I put yeah. him back in bodily. Who is but this mimic? <laughs> his spirit is not here. His yeah, soul the, has not yeah. returned. The body, but not the spirit. Yeah. yeah he's like bloated. <laughs> <laughs> my god oh no john <laughs> <laughs> laughing while crying emoji <laughs> please come home <laughs>
John's losing it. He can't keep going on like this. Amazing. Well, <laughs> very good. Um, good, good work, Jacob. Thank I feel you. very sad. Thank you. Good job. I don't feel that sad. Thank right. you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Karina, <laughs> yay! Do you want to do? I do. Okay. All right, Karina. We okay. got two more comics that need Garfield returned to them. <laughs> well, three, but two <laughs> to choose from. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe if we put Garfield back in all of them, his spirit will come back. Yeah. It'll reform. From wherever it's gone. It's like a Beetlejuice situation. You gotta say it three times. Yeah. Uh, Julia, can you please roll a number for Karina? Two or three? You'll never believe this. Is it what? two? It's two. We didn't need Dose. to roll numbers at all. We're just going in order. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> what? So a lot of leeway in this one. A lot of free uh, space to oh play my with. Goodness. Um oh. we just have to make sure that John's brain is protected. Well, yeah. yeah this does imply that someone <laughs> is threatening John's brain. I just who knows what that means? I feel like there's an obvious route to go here, but it's not going to put Garfield back in any capacity. <laughs> <laughs> not really. Not truly. Will I be the only one who actually does the prompt today? Um, we'll see. <laughs> Don't get your hopes up. Nope. <laughs> I've yet to do a prompt. Before we started recording, I said what this episode was. I said it was putting Garfield back into Garfield <laughs> minus Garfield. And the first question Julia asked was, do we have to draw Garfield? <laughs> and, and I'm like, I well, stand by this question. <laughs> that's, that's sort of the general conceit of the episode. But I just don't know what Garfield hmm. looks like is the problem. You can look at a picture of Garfield. No. I you literally can just, just look did at it. a picture of Garfield. <laughs> no. Anytime you want, honestly. Yeah, they're out there. They're available. This is a an unprecedented time for Garfield pick for availability. Garfield viewing. <laughs> yeah. We have these devices in our pockets that allow us to view Garfield anytime we want. You know those like predictions from the early 1900s of what the future would be like? And a lot of them are very accurate. There's like the the female pilot that's talking into a video phone. Yeah, yeah. You know, stuff like that. I want that image, but instead of talking to someone, they're just looking at a Garfield. In the future, even women will be able to look at Garfield. <laughs> they won't need permission from their husbands. <laughs> this so is loud. the future liberals want. This is so loud. Is it? What are you Is he a pope? What are you doing mm -hmm. to him? What do you put on his head? Is this Doraemon? Because his brain's getting stolen. Oh, oh. no. Should I walk Garfield's this back? Brain? Oh, so this is why Garfield is how he is in my comic. <laughs> <laughs> they lobotomized him, Scoop. <laughs> they lobotomized Garfield. <laughs> oh, my God. That's scary. This is what I like to call emergent narratives right here. Yeah. <laughs> This is what I like to call emergency narrative. Is this too here. violent? <laughs> no, no, it's I love it's it. a cartoonish lobotomy. Yeah. It's Again, cartoon violence. It's like the early 1900s cartoons and you're like, they say we've gotten more violent as time's gone on? Have you seen these cartoons? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they go crazy in these. Yeah. Like Bugs Bunny's got a gun. Jerry lobotomizes Tom at least 4 times an episode. <laughs> Why yeah. he becomes cheese? That's why he becomes cheese. <laughs> I said what I said. I don't know if that's why he becomes cheese. It's definitely a part of it, though. I won't fault you on that one. I think becoming cheese is what he wants to do. I mean, regardless, becoming, becoming cheese is what I want to do. What's stopping you? The more you age, the more people are like, "Yes, beautiful. You stinky, great. <laughs> You're gross looking, great." Yes. Are you saying that you're aging like a cheese ages? <laughs> yeah, I Where am get, aging like a cheese you get stinkier ages. Stinkier and grosser and covered yeah. in mold. Yeah, but I want people to appreciate me like they appreciate an aging cheese. Like I, see. I am aging like the cheese, but no one's appreciating me like the cheese. I see. See what I'm saying? Yeah. I you see know? what you're Instead, saying. Instead they're like, ew. Stop. Stop. Don't be around here. You're getting dehydrated. You stinky. You smell you get, really bad. You smell really bad. You're covered in blue spots. You smell bad. You look bad. You're you're harshing the vibe. Yeah. You're making everyone sad. 
like you gotta you can't come in here but cheese they they invite that cheese in that's true and like the fanciest <laughs> restaurants yes they're like mm, yum 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 please yes i'll pay tons of money for this me they're like there's no amount of money no I i'd pay, I'd pay for you to leave you. yeah <laughs> i'm begging you <laughs> it was a very messy drawing well that's okay it'll look yeah. better later just trust the process drawing is not supposed to look good yeah art's supposed to look bad yeah yeah that's what i think it's yeah. supposed to make you feel things other than happy mm -hmm. it's supposed to be confusing yeah, yeah. upsetting upsetting Much what, like. what if we did like as a people all agree this is this is bad for us by the way what i'm suggesting here okay mm -hmm. i'm listening we all agree to like completely invert artistic standards Mm -hmm. So that like the most accomplished artists, that's bad now. Mm -hmm. And the people who are like the, the worst artists, that's good now. That's what we want now. Well, here's the case for that, You're right? Just describing outs of your art. But I'm saying like this becomes the new norm. Like we all agree we're going to teach our kids yeah. that like the first thing you draw ever is the best. Yeah. And then well, if you learn to draw, expression. if you learn to draw, it's bad and no one likes it. Yeah. Because then you're putting rules to art. And like, what's the point of that? It's supposed to be expression, pure expression. Yeah, I feel like you're not, you're not grasping my thought experiment fully. No, I'm, I'm agreeing with it. I'm saying yes. Are you talking Art to me? Should be I'm, bad. I'm drawing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm listening. I'm listening. I'm just drawing something bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's good. Okay. If you draw, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you draw without rules. That's like a pure expression. What is art if not expression? Yeah, but I'm saying that if you draw well, that's bad now. Yeah, I agree. So I'm saying that if you draw bad, it's because you're not, you didn't study any of the art rules. Yeah, which is good. Which is good. Now. Because that's pure expression. Because we're inverting it. Yes. We're changing it. We're changing the paradigm. I'm agreeing with you and you aren't. You're agreeing with me, but I was more going for like a what, you know, what would it? mean for society sort of thing i wasn't really looking for agreement i guess i mean don't worry the society will probably still not respect artists <laughs> <laughs> well, that's nothing not my really concern here. yeah it'll all be the same you mean that society will go ew you have dedicated your life to art ew what an idiot what yeah. an idiot why didn't you do accounting or whatever Wow, that's never happened. <laughs> yeah, that's so new. That's You're so right. new. New How world refreshing. order. I can't imagine a world. What if we pivot to accounting? <laughs> we I mean, just account <laughs> make videos of us accounting. Yeah, we're just accounting, account fee. <sighs> we're going to balance Garfield's books today. Yeah. Um, I've but set up a fake QuickBooks. The for lasagna expenses, I think, are the real issue here that we're noticing we can cut down on the lasagna expenses i think we can we can get garfield in the green i do wonder if anyone's like kept a record of how many lasagnas garfield's eaten over the years and then i want to calculate like the average expense or the average price of a lasagna and see how much money garfield spent on lasagnas how many <laughs> she's, she's googling it has garfield eaten okay yep what's the number okay give us a number <laughs> so according to this reddit post Mm -hmm. of they did the math oh thank they would okay a reddit post <laughs> where they did math about a cartoon he's eaten Colin reportedly about seventy-seven thousand eight hundred and fifty-one lasagnas <laughs> holy shit i don't shit. think one cat should eat that much i don't think a person should eat that much that's too many lasagnas how many weeks are in a person's life now we need to Google how many weeks are in a person's life. <laughs> <laughs> On average. On average, I'm saying. This is what we need to know. So, and then this says that the, the cost of a lasagna updated in 2023 says a homemade lasagna will cost 15 to $40 if you consider all the ingredients, if you do not already have them. All right, so we're calculating two things at the same time here. So we're just going to okay. bounce back and forth. Yeah, go for it. There's 5,217 weeks, 5, weeks in 100 years. Okay. So that's like a human life of 100 years if you live to be 100. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
And Garfield's eaten 77,000 lasagnas. Is this what you're telling me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you'd have to eat. How many lasagnas do you have to eat in a week to, to make that happen? It's like 12, 13 lasagnas a week or something. So this says everything I'm seeing, the average price of a lasagna is between 15 to to $40 on average. So let's say it's about 30 bucks per lasagna, right? So 30 lasagnas times 77,000. Garfield has spent, or I guess John, John has spent $2,335,530 <laughs> on lasagnas for Garfield alone. <laughs> That's why he wants him to come back. Oh my God. But this tells you how the economy has changed because John just has like a, a normal office job. And John's he can a cartoonist. Pay. What? Isn't John a cartoonist? He, yeah. Is he? At one point. How much money is he making on cartoons that he can pay for two million three hundred thirty? <laughs> well, how many, much money has Jim Davis made? John Arbuckle. <laughs> Annual income. <laughs> <laughs> Annual. <laughs> While you're looking that up, I just want to make it clear that a human who lived 100 years would have to eat 15 lasagnas a week to eat as many <laughs> lasagnas as Garfield has eaten up to this point. So what, like two a day and then one cheat day? Easy. <laughs> one cheat day. <laughs> <laughs> but you'd have to start from the moment you were born. Like, I don't know how old you have to be before you can even start eating a lasagna, a full lasagna. <laughs> so you're just playing catch up for a while? Yeah, so you'd have to do even more to, to make up for like the first however many years that you are <laughs> incapable of eating two lasagnas a day. And three on a cheat day. <laughs> so I actually found a Reddit thread that's talking about exactly what we're talking about. It says John Arbuckle is in crippling debt. <laughs> well, yeah, I could have guessed that. Because he also has to pay for dog care, cat care, mortgage, and lasagna. That explains why John is the way he is. Yeah. Can and we it, talk about Karina's comic for a second? I would love to <laughs> circle back on this. <laughs> we got we got a little lost in the weeds and now I just I just want to address that we all have this person in our life where we're having the worst day of our life and our friend comes in and is like well, no one's going to steal my brain. <laughs> they make it about themselves. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. He's being selfish. They see you laying on the floor or table or whatever this is. And they're yeah. like, well, that's not going to happen to Like, me. this isn't a direct prequel to the previous comic, but it's maybe like three or four out. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah like, yeah, yeah. He, he realized in this moment he could have been less selfish. Yeah. Can you do me a favor, Karina? No. Can you do me a favor, Karina? What? <laughs> can you can you reopen my comic and just sort of add like a like a Frankenstein esque line on Garfield's head <laughs> that's like sutured up? Okay. There's not a lot of room for yeah. it on account of the eyes. <laughs> easy, easy. Oh, no, it goes behind easy. the eyes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so how are you gonna render this then? Are we rendering this? Yeah, we're gonna render it. Okay. Are you gonna render it suture or? Pre-suture or post-suture? Post-suture. This okay. is the new right. uh, the new canon version of this comic. Yeah, okay. it'll be in the render and you'll be like, why? Yeah. And then now you'll then know. Then now you'll know. Now you'll see yeah, so. the truth. <laughs> All right. So is it is it time for me? We still haven't. We oh, actually yeah. sent Garfield away, <laughs> <laughs> if anything. <laughs> All right. It's my job to bring yeah. Garfield home. Bring him home. <laughs> we miss him so much. I, I know what the third comic is, and I don't know how it's going to bring Garfield home. I'll tell um, you that much. I'm excited. I have an idea in my head of how I want to solve this, but we'll see if it's the comic. You haven't even seen the comic. Yeah. All right, get in here. It's time for me to draw. Uh, comic number three. <laughs> so this one's a little. It's perfect, though. <laughs> I mean, I do like that it, at the end of it, Odie is looking at you, Julia, <laughs> as if to say, like, why'd you fucking do this? Why'd yeah. you draw this? Yeah. It's just Garfield slumped over. Again. <laughs> <laughs> you were supposed to bring him home. You didn't do it. You were the chosen one. 
<laughs> Julia, please, please look at a picture of Garfield. Who is that? Please look at a picture of Garfield. <laughs> Oh, it's my phone on the couch. Yeah. You threw it away. I did. <laughs> You're like, I will not look at Garfield. Thank I was you. so determined to not look at On a room. Monday? Sacrilegious. Yeah. Garfield doesn't like that. Um, not John Arbuckle's annual salary. Just John Arbuckle, <laughs> please. <laughs> yeah, just the, the man himself, please. Google knows what I want to know, but <laughs> this time I must do. It's constantly trying to learn, and every time it's like, oh, come on. <laughs> Now I'm looking at John Arbuckle. So you're drawing in John right now. Yeah. Yeah. Adding him to this. Yeah. Tableau. That's not John's <laughs> eyes. These are oh, John's oh. eyes. These aren't my beautiful John's <laughs> eyes. <laughs> kind of wall-eyed. Ah, you know what that suits. All right. Um, John, like, doesn't have a nose. He has this, which I guess is a shortcut of a nose. He has, like, yeah. an anime nose. It's the shadow under his nose. Okay. I'm a shadower under my nose. <laughs> <laughs> I would so sniff I, him. Yeah, so I could sniff his hair. I would huff his scent. <laughs> and I would remember the smell for the rest of my days. Spicy, Spicy shadow <laughs> scent. Is there a shadow the hedgehog scented candle? Probably. Let's go. Back to Google. <laughs> it's a Google heavy episode. I own. Uh, there almost certainly is, but it's like gonna be on Etsy. Shadow the. I mean, on on a very old dorkly Sonic thing, candle. I bought or someone bought Sonic the Hedgehog wine and Sonic the Hedgehog <laughs> body wash or something. Did you did you find it? The first like the first thing that came up under sponsored when I googled Shadow the Hedgehog scented candle is just a candle with a picture of Shadow the Hedgehog and it says I love piss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i don't think that smells like shadow though i think they just put that picture on it yeah what is it? Oh, oh you can you can choose what you want him to smell like but piss isn't even an option Just i don't want to choose i want the authentic smell yeah the smell of shadow <laughs> This is a unhinged looking John. <laughs> Don't you see, Odie? We can bring him back. He's there. He's there, Odie. You see him, right? <laughs> no, he's like, sure don't. <laughs> Just like yesterday, John. <laughs> Why have we made Garfield minus Garfield sadder? <laughs> we weren't supposed to make it sadder. And we haven't even additioned Garfield. <laughs> We're so bad at our job. <laughs> what else is new? Who is that? <laughs> I just looked up. I looked up from my <laughs> Etsy search. And there's a strange man in the room. This is a man in a in a cat hat. Yeah. Did John hire this man? Who knows? Is this sort of like a Craigslist <laughs> thing? I like that Odie's looking at his tits. <laughs> 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 My eyes are up here. <laughs> but he's like, damn, that's a wide man. <laughs> oh, the lovely tangent there. Yeah, yeah, I fixed it. I, fixed I thought it. you were going to like have him put his arm around Odie. <laughs> I love you, Odie. <laughs> I'm home, Odie. <laughs> you don't have to be sad anymore, Odie. <laughs> Are you going to add dialogue? Is that? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm so excited. <laughs> I really should cram it up there. <laughs> Text is sitting on his head. Come on. Come in. on in. <laughs> That's exactly what John would say. <laughs> but then in this image, John is gone. Well, he's walked. He's walked that way. He's walked. He's walked. Jacob. I'll have the back of John's head. Yeah, where's he going? To make a lasagna. Oh, of course. He's like, I have all this spare spending money. I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> <have> Two million dollars. <laughs> I keep just buying lasagna on habit. I have a lasagna ready. <laughs> there you go. Is this anything? 
Yes, it's everything. Yeah, it's definitely two panels of <laughs> incredible Garfield content. Yeah. So and then far. the last panel, they're just making out in the background. <laughs> <laughs> the lady and tramping the lasagna. Is this the one episode we'll never release of Trophy? Why would we never release it? I don't know. No, this is what do you people not, want. Do you not want people to see this? What are you ashamed of? I think of? people should see this. This is important, With I their think. eyes and with their soul. And hear what we have to say with their ears. And their hands. And their hands. Touch the screen. <laughs> Feel the content. Are you? Are you feeling the content? Does it have a heartbeat? <laughs> Here's an alternate version just for Karina. Instead of this man, it's a very confused Kotetsu <laughs> having to do a side gig. <laughs> My poor pussy. He's yeah. Like... <laughs> and he's domesticated? Interesting. <laughs> He's shaved his beard to look like Garfield's hair. Yeah. He's shaved his entire head to look like, <laughs> I don't know, a cat. <laughs> Is this man was just out celebrating Halloween and was like, yeah, okay. Said he had lasagnas. That's all. It's free lasagna. It's free lasagna. It's an alarming amount of free lasagna. <laughs> You spent how many just, millions on lasagna? I can't eat this many lasagnas he just per day. comes over every day to get his lasagna rations and then yeah. he goes home to his wife. <laughs> his two lasagnas per day and three on Sunday. <laughs> it's cheat day. <laughs> it's cheat day. It's a day of rest. Yeah. <laughs> Are you planning to put anything in the third panel or no? no? <laughs> Odie is not happy with this outcome. Yeah, no, this is it. Yeah. I feel like we need just a bit of that guy walking off panel for consistency's for sake. Continuity. Yeah, for continuity. <laughs> or else or else I'll be confused. Like where did he go? He's they're ignoring Odie entirely yeah. and just go walking towards the kitchen. <laughs> Mind where he came from. I just want to know where did he go. Is this Cotton Eye Joe? <laughs> no, that's Garfield. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and then Odie looks out to you, Julia. Yeah. To say, you could have done better. <laughs> you could have brought Garfield home, but you didn't. You failed, Julia. <laughs> <laughs> you could have you could have brought him home instead. Yeah. Everyone's reading their paper like who's Julia? <laughs> <laughs> and where's Garfield? <laughs> like the real Garfield. I can't believe Jim Davis drew this comic on yeah. June 26th. <laughs> Gar <laughs> Garth Feel Field. Garth Field. Garth Field. There you go. Wow. <laughs> I diagnose you with Garfield. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Field. <laughs> Well, well we've, we failed our task. Just completely. <laughs> yeah. You started it. Yeah, but I didn't mean to. I just drew Garfield <laughs> bad. <laughs> and look at what came of it. Look at what we've done. A whole episode. <laughs> well, maybe this means we can do another episode, and maybe then we'll manage to bring Garfield home. <laughs> yeah, if you want to see us attempt this again, please, please say so in the comments. <laughs> we'll keep making these until we bring him home. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's out there somewhere, right? Yeah, he's got to be. We're going to find him, and we're going to mm -hmm. bring him back. Yeah, mm -hmm. body and soul. Yeah. But thanks for watching, everybody. <laughs> we hope you've enjoyed this beautiful art we've made today. And if you did, get the like button in your eyesight line and then use your hand to click it <laughs> yeah. along with the subscribe button. And then go on over to our Patreon. You can support us there. It helps us out a lot if you do. Mm-hmm. And also you can you can suggest things even more easily over there in the Discord in our episode suggestion channel where I got this suggestion from. <gasps> yes. We also stream every week, Monday night, 7 p.m. And we got a merch store. DFTBA. Full of merch. Full yeah. of merch. We're sorry. 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 <laughs>